Hello everybody and welcome. Today we are playing Fable Anniversary. My favorite of the fables. So we're going to be starting a new game. I've, I've played this one a bunch. I've played all three of them. I'm very excited for the new Fable to come out, Fable 4. Um, I'm not sure if they've come out with a release date for that yet. But I'm just really looking forward to playing this. So we're just going to jump right into it. Can I, if I beat the game, can I do it on different difficulty? So I've never played this on PC before. I'm very excited. Deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving, and stay out of trouble. Okay, so... This game looks a lot better and worse at the same time. Uh, the graphics look better. The dad's hair looked a little bit weird. Uh, press tab. Hello. <laughs> Susie. I, I left her, and I can't remember where. I know her. Uh, Furry bear. Like a blue patch on her back. Blue patch. Got it. So for any of you who haven't played this game, this is a story about this guy who uh, is the hero of the lands, who is only referred to as hero. Really. And yeah, you just grow your fable as either a good guy or a bad guy. Or yeah, neutral, I guess. What? Hey, what's up? Uh, I was just, um, I'm, I've never even met this woman. Who is yeah, she? Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? I know about that. My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. You're supposed to be. But a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what, if you keep this little secret... Bribing a child, a huh? Uh, no. Just don't tell my wife. We? Are good people. We're gonna be the good guy. I am gonna have to get used to using these controls, though. I'm only used to playing it on a controller. I might switch to a controller eventually, if this proves to be a little too awkward for me. Hello. Honestly, where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? Oh, I know where he is. <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children. Where are your what children? Do I get in return. If you find him, let me know, won't you? Uh, yeah. You have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into Balverine food. Thank you, Balverine. you, sir, for telling me. You performed a good deed. Thank you. Uh, let's go do this one. See, so, yeah, we're just gonna speed through this beginning. Oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? You look different than I remember. I've got to, you know... Answer the call of nature. Oh, what she want? Stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just yes, stand I am a good lad. And don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right. With who? Ah. Uh, 
Our first annoyance. Well, he's away. Let's smash those barrels and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blabbing girl. Now I'm all set. Yes, I am going to just stand here like a lemon. But I get paid. No, go away. No, I don't wanna. Oh, you're no fun at all. Go away. Is he following me? Yeah, he is. Hey, piss off. Fine. Have your stupid good deed then. I fucking will. There he comes. You know, you could have just walked by in these crates and taken a piss. Excellent well, you probably had to take a deuce. You've done me a big favor. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. Nice haircut, bitch. <laughs> got him. Fucking got him. Ooh, okay. Stupid little idiot. Hey. Get him off me. Please help. You look like the other kid, except for you have a tooth and slightly bigger hair. For good? You want me to fuck kill him? I'll do it. Uh. Oh fuck! I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. I back fucking heel kicked him. Thank you. You stopped him good. Thank you. You got fucking weird yes. teeth. I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Fucking damn right, Rosie. Yeah, that patch is not on her back. It's on her fucking ass. Let's get out of here. We're getting left good deeds left and right. Fucking love this game. Always have. Loved all three of them. For the, th uh, the first one. Oh, shit. I keep forgetting what Interact is. You found Rosie. I did. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Look at those vacant fucking eyes. Stuffing. Do people change the stuffing of their animals? Is that a thing? I've never thought about that. Do, do people actually do that? Oh no. Let's go check with dad. See what he's doing. Hey, what's up? Are these two back here? You filthy swine! I ought to chop them right off! Okay. Don't insult me! Okay. Fucking chicken. Let's get over here. Talk to well big done. old dad. Here's your reward for those good deeds. His hair looks like a fucking wig. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? No, you just gave me the goddamn money. Okay. I feel weird that right click is uh my run. And not like, I don't know, shift. I could probably change it, but I don't wanna. I'm a trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially. I like his fucking jacket. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. Fuck it. Was it Rosie? Did Rosie tell you the teddy bear? She, she's getting her stuff and changed right now. No, I haven't. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of Your mustache is thin guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces yeah is that is that right young sir they are yours wish your sister a happy birthday from me now won't you i really won't you're a wandering traitor better stay away from my sister you're a good boy Who yeah knows? i am perhaps one day you'll be a town Oh, that was a bird. I don't want to be a town guard. I want to be an actor. Teresa, the most important character. Hello, little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. 
I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. Oh, here you go. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on, let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. I don't remember her being a redhead. Uh, call me crazy. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! It's really happening. They're here. You've got to hide. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was then they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. It's fucking. I'm stuck. Okay. So, um, I'm not gonna be talking during cutscenes, as you probably have noticed. Um, I will talk during when I'm just talking to regular people, and I guess I could click through it. I might stop if you guys think I should. It's up to you guys. I don't care either way. Uh oh. Uh oh, daddy oh. leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. <coughs> hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. 
You don't look much like hero material to me, but Mays knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. <laughs> it's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Okay, Whisper. You look a lot better than you used to in the uh, Xbox game. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! Yes, yes. Let, let us be off. Uh, yeah. So, we're going to be playing this game to its completion. Uh, let's play style. There's going to be episodes, just like every other game I've been playing. But this will be more story-based than my other games, obviously. I will not be talking during cutscenes, like I said. And uh, the stuff where I have to click through uh, people, this conversation, I might talk more. Unless I feel it's just an important bit of information. So, yeah. You finally prized your... Hello. All right, lad. It's time to see if you have any potential. Plenty. Get in the ring. I got plenty. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. You won't tell me what the fucking. How do I lock on? I don't know how to lock on. You're not making much of an impact there, are you? I click. Here, I think I clicked try with it. this. Get that equipped. Uh, I thought I did equip it. Oh, I have to pull it out. What is my lock on? Oh no. Ah, now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. Mm. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. What if I don't want to learn anything? Left shift. Damn. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like what a, be something loose. What a wood. soft alarm. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. Got none. I'll wait for you at the Guildwood's entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Yo, let's fucking do it. Uh... A powerful mon. Uh, thank you. To the guild woods. Let's go. We're gonna fucking beat some beetle ass. Oh, the beetles look different as well. Oh, 
Okay, so this is my lock on, I think. Oh no. I don't really need one. Kind of like the auto lock's got me covered. Damn, that was hard fought. Oh, we need a cookie. And like a lay down. Let's go back and turn this in to our guild master. I wonder what his real name is. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here. I'm only a child. You've earned yourself some pocket money for that. Don't swear in front of me. more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. Uh, do you wish to leave your child and begin training? No. Come and see me when you're ready. You okay. look tired after killing those beetles. You know what? Maybe I am. You ever think about that? Maybe I am. Let's grab these apples. Oh, it feels weird that tab is what I use to pick stuff up. Uh. Okay, is that all of them? I think that's all of them. Let's uh, head this way. All the green dots on our map are possible quests. Uh, the gold one, that's our main quest. If we had silver ones flashing, those are side objectives. Let's go talk to this lovely... Why do they have servants? Can you help me out? I have to make an apple pie for the guildmaster at the end of the week. But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another four. You are in if luck. You find enough, can you bring them back here? You are in luck. I just so happen Thanks. to have Thank him. You so much. The guildmaster will get his pie. Here, have this. What I don't understand is she says I need to make I have or I have to make him an apple pie. Why? Like, are you actually like a servant who can't actually like like not paid? I don't know. Probably not. I'm just reading too much into it, I think. We're discussing whether I'm the fastest apprentice in this guild. I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds. Yeah. Beat that. Did you? Right then. Get to the demon door and back okay. and talk to me okay. in 50 seconds. I did it in 50 seconds. Okay, okay, okay. I can never do this first try. Maybe with a, a mouse and keyboard, I'll actually do it. Ugh. God, I'm always tense at this. It's always the worst. I can never do it first try. Who is that? You're in my way. You're in my way. Okay. That turn was not easy. I fucked up. Oh, damn. Oh, no. That turn was not how I expected it to go. I didn't turn on the dime like I thought I would. I thought all I'd have to do was swing the mouse. Oh fuck. I'm gonna be late. I'm gonna be late. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, well, if it wasn't for oh my god. Amazing. How did you do oh it? my god. I lost my bet. Shit. I've never actually done that. I usually come up like a second short. Hey, what's up? What's up? Yes. Big deal. Running's for idiots anyway. <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Yes. Big deal. Running's for idiots anyway. <laughs> I don't uh, know how he did it. Fucker. I always win guild competitions. Uh, fucker. Oh. The journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face? The signs are too strong to ignore, and the northern wastes have been too long isolated from the guild. There is much I may learn there. Well, I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight, trying to cheat death again. You know how people talk. Talk is of no matter to me. May death close his eyes to you, Maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. 
That was Sai. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make, of what it takes to get things done? How ominous of a thing for you to say. Can I talk to you? No, boy. You're supposed to report to the but, guildmaster, not me. But you can always find out where he is by looking at your map. But no. And also, I never noticed he had a little chin squaggle, like a little uh, chin hair. Um. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to Fable Four. Um, I really hope they do keep the uh the British sort of funniness to it, like the British underwear and the way they talk. Like, I really hope they keep that form of humor going. It's always been one of the best staples of this game, in my opinion. I've always enjoyed these games. Uh, but for now, I think we will have to call that an episode. Uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think about, uh, how I should do the voicing. If I should not talk during any other character, or if I'm clicking through it, should I just talk because it's of not as important. But, yeah, it's all up to you guys, uh, whatever you feel. I'll probably record the first couple episodes in a row, just to kind of get them out there. But I will definitely... Uh, take your guys' word, whatever you guys think is best, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to keep up with the series, hit that bell. If you're enjoying it already, hit that like button. And if you guys want to talk to me for any reason whatsoever, put it down in the comments. But thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, stay cool, stay class, and I'll see you all in the next episode.